Good morning, everybody. I thought I would jump on here before I get my day started. It's, uh, what day is it? It's Monday the 19th, August 19th. And I thought, sorry, um, shadows sitting on the end table on the very corner of it. And I'm not sure if it's going to tip, so I'm just kind of watching. Um, but I thought I'd come on here and answer my number no, she didn't tip it. Um, my number one question being asked right now, and that is, and I find it a very odd question, to be honest with you. Um, and I'm going to explain more to detail this. But um, my number one question I'm being asked is, why did you put your living room, family room, parlor, um, depends on what part of the world you live in as to what you call it, um, in your basement, off of your bedroom, and not upstairs where you're going to put your office. Okay, now, number one, I find that to be the weirdest question ever because, um, how many people have living rooms and their children's bedrooms are off the living room? Um, it's not uncommon to have bedrooms off of living rooms it's really it isn't um second the question was like privacy the privacy okay we do have a, a a pocket door it has frosted glass on it um so you can't see in there if the door's closed since we've moved here we have not closed that door once um i haven't even washed the, the panes on it yet um, our kids don't really come down here terribly often. They like Katie comes down here during the day and we'll sit on the couch and that. That's really about it. Um, also, our laundry room is in our bathroom. Like, so if you go, you have to go through our bedroom to get to the laundry. And so, again, um, there's people coming and going out of our bedroom. Anyway, well, not people, like mostly me, but the kids go through there as well. Um, and then, what else was it? I think those were the big ones, was the, the privacy. When we go to bed, our kids are typically in bed, because my husband and I typically go to bed between uh, 9 and 10. We're old, okay. Um, not really. We do a lot of stuff during the day and we're up fairly early. We're up typically between 5 and 7 in the morning, every morning. Um, so we get up long before the kids as well. But anyway, that's not part of the point. Um, so why didn't we put it upstairs and not have, and you know, why would I not put it upstairs and not have my office downstairs to begin with? If I have my office down here, I'm constantly going to be working. Um, and that was my problem at our old house was my off. I didn't have an office. My office was in my bedroom in front of my bed. Um, I had stuff everywhere. I had stuff in the kitchen. I had stuff in the dining room. I had stuff in my room. Um, I had some things that even out in the living room, um, because the house was small. I didn't have a place where I could just have everything in one spot. Whereas here I can, which is going to be amazing. Um, but we're putting it upstairs, so in that way, it's up where the kitchen is, because that's, you know, where I do a lot of my filming is in my kitchen or sitting down like this. Um, so it'll just be easier because everything is just boom right there. Also, um, I'm going to be honest, I hate hearing the TV. Um, <laughs> And my husband hates hearing me in the kitchen. So this works out even better. Like, yes, I can see my kitchen. What if I really look, like I really have to look, but I can't hear the TV um, when it's on down here, when I'm upstairs and he can't hear me when I'm upstairs down here. Um, so that works as well. Also, it was, we seen this area and we're like, yes, this is a living room. Um, I'm going to show you guys all the rooms after I have everything done because I think this week I'm going to do another um, 
follow me for the week kind of thing. Today is an easy day for me of not doing much. But um, anyway, now why I find it silly people asking this and getting so, I don't know, they find it strange that we did this. In our other house, our bedroom was off the kitchen. There was no privacy <laughs> in that room. Um, if you were in the kitchen, you could hear everything from a bedroom, like a, any bedroom. Um, there was no privacy in that other house. This house, lots of privacy, which is fantastic. I love that. Um, but yes, that's, that's why our kids barely ever use the living room. Every one of them have TVs in their rooms and all of you are going to think, oh, your children are spoiled. Our children paid for their TVs and their Xboxes with their own money. They bought it. We did not provide it. They bought it. Um, oh, don't think that we have, you know, encouraged that because we didn't, they bought it themselves. Um, so yeah, they typically hang out up there. The odd time, Katie will come down and watch something with me. That's not too terribly often. So yeah, the living room is mostly my husband and I. Um, and then entertaining people. If we're entertaining people, we're not going to be in our bedroom. Um, maybe other people will be, I, I don't know, but uh, in, in here, in this house, that, that doesn't happen. Um, <laughs> put that out there. Um, so yeah, for us, this works. And it's going to be nice having the office away from the bedroom where it's like, I can stop working. Like right now, my office is down here in the living room because we are painting the upstairs this week. Yeah, we're waking up this week. It'll probably flow into next week as well. But yeah, so for right at the moment, it's down in my living room, which is not really bothering anybody. But yeah, that's why. Okay. If other people find it strange, well, hey, that's okay. For us, it doesn't even, doesn't even register for us. It's just how we want the house to flow. So I hope that answers everybody's question. And I'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bye.